Hey guys, so I'm going to show you how to do um, this new, um, I've never actually seen this on YouTube before, and um, mine's not done, but, not finished, but, yeah, they kind of look ugly right now, as I'm looking at them through camera, but they will look pretty. So I'm going to show you how to do this beach kind of look. So I'm going to the beach and yeah. So this is gonna be this goodbye tutorial. So goodbye. Um I'm leaving on Sunday and it is about to be Saturday, so yeah. I guess this is goodbye. Goodbye. Anyway, um so I'm gonna do this thumb. So you gotta do it with the thumb. So what you're gonna need is blue paint. I mean blue nail polish, white paint, green paint, dark brown paint, yellow paint, and if you would like, orange nail polish. Take your blue and paint it. And I'm going to do the whole look on this nail. This video isn't going to be a really goodbye video. The next video that I'm going to do is... So this one isn't. This is just going to... Yeah. But I mean, this other... This next video that I'm going to do is going to be my last video until I get back. I'm kind of bad at painting with this hand because this isn't the hand that I write with. And you're going to need clear nail polish too. But I only got this one out right now at the moment. And do your moisturizing for your nails, whatever you do at the beginning before you paint them. But I didn't want to make the video short. So after you have that, let that dry a night. But take, oh, you're going to need two sponges, two like sponges like this. Take the white and just sponge it on there. If you, um, if you do it with the white, well, it's, if you do it, like, if you sponge the white on while the blue is still wet, you don't need a second sponge. But then, actually, you might. Just move it out. Take your second sponge at the corner and just smooth it out. And these are going to be the clouds. So now, let that dry. And you're wondering what's the next video going to be? Well, it's going to be on um, what I am packing to go to the vacation. Okay, so this hand, it's not done. I haven't did the palm tree yet. It just has the suns in it. And I think um, this, this sun, it actually came out better. Can you see the sun? Yes, it is. it's yellow. Yeah. So, there that is. Take, um, Yellow and a toothpick. Oh yeah, you're gonna need a toothpick also. Forgot that. Take a big blob of it and put it at a corner. And I reckon to do the designs with paint, not nail polish, is because it goes on better and it sticks up better. You don't have to let dry the paint. Then Take from that and bring three or more lines out. I'm just I've done through three for all my nails. Doesn't matter how much you've done. You can do as many as you would like. But I'm just gonna do 
a few, and that sound didn't really turn out that well, but it's okay. in a different angle, but yeah. So, you're going to make me need two toothpicks, no, three, to do each color. Now, take your brown, squirt it out somewhere. And you're probably thinking, well, acrylic can, paint can mess up your nails. It can't. So, pick a spot on your nail where you want your palm tree to be. This is going to be the um, bark. Okay. Make a line. Like so. And this is great, especially if you're going to the beach. You know you want to show off your fingernail look. Then why don't you do it? So here's how. Everybody's going to be um, asking you and complimenting on your nails. Where did you go get your nails done at? They're so pretty. How did you do it? And you're going to be like, well, <laughs> where did I get them done at? At home. <laughs> and, um, how did you do it? YouTube. Beaver Lover 353. So, please go mention me if you do go to the beach and you do uh, do this look. Let me ask you, please give me credit Do it on each and every nail. Take, let that dry, but just take your green. And yeah, I'm going to wipe away it. Um, excess nail polish. Take your green, squirt that out. Take another toothpick, put some on it. Okay, so, then from that, you're just going to do little lines coming out from it to make it look like it's a, um, cherry. I don't know if you can see it, but it's really cute. Yeah, it's super cute, right? You should really try this look, like... I swear to you, um, a lot of people is going to be complimenting and asking you about your nails. I bet you. No joke. I bet you. Like, I swear to God. Well, I, I know I don't swear to God because it may not happen if you don't go to the beach. Duh. But you can also remember that if you just go out somewhere with this look on you and they ask you, please give me credit. Mm, mention my channel, please. Because I really want it to be noticed.
although a lot of girls don't watch my channel, but watch my videos and stuff, but, oh well. I do my thumb at the end of a table, because it's easier for me that way. Why is it always easy to do your thumb, like, at the end of the table? Wait, can somebody tell me that? There it is. There it is. Your beach. There's your beach in it. There's your beach inspired nail look. You know, you're going to want to let, this, since it's paint, the paint that I'm using, it dries pretty fast. But, so you're going to want to let it stick, well, dry for about 20 to 30 minutes, I'd say. For 10 to 20 minutes. So yeah. Because that'll equal 30. <laughs> no. Um, so, but the at least, uh, the, the minimum that you would need for your nose to dry all the way, like unless you put a glob of paint on there, it will be 30 for the little amount of paint. But if you put like a glob, I'd say 40. Maybe around... 40, 41, I don't know, somewhere in there, um, but yeah, not an hour, like, def that'd be like, draw, 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 yeah, but, <laughs> just let them dry for 10 to 20 minutes, or 20 to 30, and that would be 50 minutes, if you let it 10, uh, 20 to 30, that would be 50, um, so thank you guys for watching, and be sure to check out my next video. But I gotta let my fingernails dry before I do that. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Bye.